You are now entering the Divine Headquarters. What's up, fam? It's your big bro Joey here. Um, I want to let y'all know that Retrograde got your boy again. And what I mean by that is that I recorded a whole video for y'all. Um, it was almost 30 minutes or so. And when I went to save it, the video didn't save. It wasn't saving. It was doing some sort of weird thing again. Um, glitching. Some sort of glitch again. So, uh... I got the broad idea to start to screen record it. So I screen recorded it as much as I could because about 20 minutes into the video, I got a phone call and that phone call like stopped the screen recording and it also wiped out the original video. So I posted what I was able to salvage and hopefully you guys get something good out of it. I just want to tell y'all to keep going. Don't let nothing stop y'all. And regardless of what obstacles you come up against, regardless of what roadblocks are being set in front of you, just keep moving forward and keep a positive head on your shoulder and keep thinking uh, out of positivity. Keep sowing love into your life, sowing love and light into your life. Okay. Don't let nothing stop you. Um, even though sometimes these, these things can get aggravating, but <laughs> You know, just keep going, keep moving forward, okay? Y'all take care. Hope you guys enjoy it. Hope you're having an awesome day. Hope you had a good weekend. Ciao. What is up, fam? It's your big bro, Joy. Welcome back to the channel. Much love and light to everybody out there. I want to welcome back to the channel my OGs. Thank y'all for y'all continued love and support. And I want to welcome to the channel any new viewers. If you're liking how we are vibing over here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. We love to have you to be a part of the fam as well. And... Yeah, I'm, I'm recording this on a Sunday, okay? Um, it's been a very, very relaxing weekend for me as well. Um, let me know what y'all did this weekend. Let me know if y'all did something uh, exciting or like y'all did y'all relax or, like, you know, what did you get accomplished this weekend? Or I just heard what you didn't get accomplished this weekend. <laughs> just uh, share your vibes. Let me know. Let me know what y'all how your weekend was, okay? For everybody out there. So, um. Today, y'all, uh, for the for the up and coming week, what I'm gonna do is, um, and I'm gonna, I'm just testing this out to see if this is something that I'm that I'm gonna vibe with doing. Uh, if I vibe with it, and if you guys like it as well, I'm gonna be doing um, like mixed messages for Mondays, right? So we're just checking energy for the week or energy around that time period, and we're gonna touch actually touch bases in different areas. It's gonna be in love. We're gonna do spirituality. We're gonna do career. We're going to be doing um, got my little notes here. We're going to be doing money um, and maybe touching on the world arena as well. I just said world arena because I might throw in some some of these kooky cards here from the Narada uh, deck. Yeah, so let's go ahead. Let me clean this energy out so we can get started and get this show on the road because I got some things to do. You feel me? Ushering in love, light, peace, and prosperity for the collective. Thanks. Thank everybody for being here. Thank you for your continued love and support. Thank you for being the awesome people that you are. Thank y'all so much. I really do appreciate you guys. So the angel number that we have for today is 1111. How uh, fitting is that for the time period that we are in? 1111. This is that gateway energy. This is that... Um, manifestation energy this is your chance this is your opportunity we always have chances and opportunities right but this is that time where things are just like i'm getting this a beautiful it's it's, it's a beautiful time to be alive right now for the collective uh for us evolving for us moving forward in life it's a beautiful time for everybody that's what i'm getting here and 11 11 on this card represents a wish come true okay it talks talks about being in moderation i'm get that moderation thing is something that really like uh hit home with me also too just having moderation in life and balance in life in general right balance balancing out like between work and play balancing out between like what foods you what foods are you eating are you overindulging in cer certain things are you like what are you doing like are you getting letting your mind rest okay um earlier today i got a message about you know taking a social media break and uh i'm really really putting that into uh consideration not consideration i'm gonna do it you feel me but I just plan out how I'm going to do that for myself, okay? But yeah, some of you guys maybe needed to take a social media break as well because we've been bombarded with a lot of different energies. Um, 
besides all the different energies we've been picking up in the collective it's like a overload and i just looked at the butterfly this is a huge a major transformation for the collective that's coming coming about right now and this 1111 is about manifestation like i said it's a gateway it says you're in for a lucky break it may come as happy news experience new opportunities or an exciting acquaintance all right exciting i love that uh, you will find yourself in the right place at the right time. I'm hearing a song. Um, this is the life. This is a life by Kolohe Kai is what I'm hearing. This is the life is a song that I saw. So if you guys are interested in picking up on more that what that energy has to because my other phone is dead. I'm recording with this phone right here and my other one is dead. So I ain't gonna worry about it or I could plug it up. You know what? Y'all want to y'all want to delve deeper. God say let them do their work too. So if y'all want to delve deeper, look up Kolohe Kai. This is a life and look at the lyrics. It says you will find yourself in the right place at the right time. It is not a coincidence, but a gift from fate. So this is something that is meant for you. Some of you guys may have been searching for information with the get more information card here. And I feel like this is a time to where. If there were missing components in your life, in certain areas in your life, and uh, certain something that you wanted to do, um, I just heard something that you wanted to be for somebody. This is this is very well the time that you may very well find that missing information. I'm hearing the the missing link, the missing key, the missing puzzle piece to the puzzle that uh, you were trying to put together. The pieces that you're trying to put together, you were missing a piece, and now you are getting ready to to obtain that peace okay i picked um a hawaiian healing intentions card as well and the one that we got is ano okay it talks about awe and reverence okay the number on here is 11 as well bro the number is 11 11 as well it says um reverence is a state of being that can permanently liberate you from mediocrity there's nothing mediocre mediocre <laughs> there's nothing mediocre about life our small planet hangs in perfect balance in a galaxy within a universe that is believed to be over 13 billion years old. This means that it took 13 billion years to create an environment that could host you and your loved ones. Reverence invites you into a state of awe, discovery, and appreciation of yourself and the world around you. Okay, and the intention on here says my intention is to allow myself to live in reverence and awe and to recognize the miraculous creation that i am and that i am a part of so this it it, it hits it hits home in that message that this is um an awesome time for the collective to be in all right this is an auspicious time for us as a collective to be in okay so consider yourself lucky I just heard that song from Oliver. Why am I getting these songs just popping into my head? I'm just hearing that song from o Oliver. Consider yourself at home. Consider yourself one of the family. Consider yourself. Yeah, I don't know if y'all y'all heard. Comment down below if you know that that uh, that that play that musical. Oliver, uh, Mr. Owen. Um, it's just called Oliver with a quotation mark. No, with an exclamation point. Yeah, uh, yeah, that song, Consider Yourself. So you might want to look up those lyrics too. Consider yourself at home. Consider yourself one of the family. So this tells me that it, just like I've been picking up on for the longest, and that's giving me confirmation about this card that I pulled out too, is about community, okay? You guys are manifesting your soul tribe. You are manifesting your soulmates. You are bringing in like-minded individuals finally a lot of us have been living our lives um just i just heard just thugging it out alone and not really having people of like-minded um, um uh, mentalities or you know energies around us so it kind of made it kind of like you know hard at times and it kind of made it kind of like you know like damn like who else is anybody else out there that's like me um why am I hearing that song from Five Fivel? Fivel? American Tell? Somewhere out there. That somewhere out there. American Tell. What was that song? What was that movie about? That cartoon. 
I don't know. Who knows that? Who knows that American Tale cartoon? Somewhere out there beneath the pale moonlight. Uh, I don't know. Um, that's what I'm getting. I'm getting like, yeah, it says, it says something like, we'll be together somewhere out there out where dreams come true. So, yeah, I feel like someone or people, there's somebody with a specific individual, like you're looking for a certain type of experience. You're looking for somebody who's like you. You're looking for a certain individual or you were open to that person and that person is actually manifesting you. It's like you, you guys are manifesting each other. So you are manifesting a person. They're manifesting you. So that's a union. Expect some sort of union in that area to come about as well because this is your harvesting time. This is the time that the seeds that you have planted are coming to fruition. The seeds that you have planted are, are getting grown and sprouting and coming up out the ground and it's bearing fruit. So this is your time to um, to see your hard work, uh, the benefits of your hard work paying off for yourself. You're moving into a more happy energy here. This is represents happiness. So you're moving into a more happier time in your life. Uh, you're moving into a time where you're going to be feeling good about yourself, where uh, I'm, I'm getting the lightness energy, lightness energy to where uh, things are going to feel lighter, like a weight is a weight is going to be lifted off your shoulder or weights are going to be lifted off your shoulder. Burdens are going to be lifted off your shoulder in different areas of your life. Things are just going to be feeling kind of like free, like you can fly like an eagle. That song just popped into my head, too. So it's like you're going to be feeling more free in life. Um you're going to be feeling more light, okay, more airy type of energy. Um, I just heard airy fairy. I don't know. Somebody may be connected with fairies as well here. Um, but this is more light and airy type of energy that's coming in. More, I'm getting to where you could just like rest and relax a little bit. It's giving me four source energy, okay? That is what I'm getting there, okay? In love, what we have here is an apology somebody may come to you with an apology from the past for somebody here somebody that may have uh took taken the wrong steps okay somebody that may have taken the wrong steps somebody that may have uh did you dirt in the past you may have black uh bad blood with this person okay um somebody who shattered it because i'm here and you Cause now you're giving me, giving me nothing but a shattered dream, shattered dream. It's like somebody may have shattered your dreams that you had uh, for your partnership. Number two energy here. They may have caused opposition. Somebody, somebody may have gone against the connection or gone against your wishes. Um, the communication was off. Okay. You may have, you may have thought this was a divine connection between you and this person. The communication was off. Um, it came to a, a point to where there needed to be a change because the creativity was no longer, the passion was no longer there, the commitment was no longer there. Like somebody wasn't, didn't want to, didn't want to, didn't want to commit to you, or they didn't want to hold up to their end of the bargain. Okay, but now you are moving into this energy of partying and having fun, enjoying your life. Okay. Instead of and getting over being hurt, I see you phasing out of this past energy, phasing out of this turmoil type of energy is what I'm getting here. Hurting, being in agonizing pain, feeling like you're blocked, feeling like you never find that right person, feeling like everybody who you meet is always some sort of weird something going on. Um, things may be going good for a while, but then ultimately something happens and it just turns everything around or takes it into a, a, a direction that you don't want it to go into. So, yeah, you guys are moving into more so energy of partying and having fun. So God wants you to just like relax and take it easy and have fun in your life and to not to not take things too seriously and to lighten your load. It's like to to have more fun is what I'm getting. I'm getting uh, God is wanting you to have more fun. There's some sort of faded meeting. And an important connection that is coming for you guys as well, for you singles, uh, for you guys phasing out of old connections. There's a faded meeting between you and a brand new individual. Let me get, um, where we at? 
God, these cars are loud today. Let me get some energy on this faded meeting. Tower moment, bro. <laughs> this is gonna be a tower moment. It's gonna hit you at bam. You know what I'm saying? You're gonna be, you're gonna be doo -doo 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 bam. Then lightning on bam. Listen to me, like pay attention. I feel like it's gonna be that same way. I don't know why I'm picking up that kind of scenario. It's like it's gonna be that same way for you and this person. It's gonna be, and um, it's happening because this. So you may see a breaking down of past connections or connections that don't serve your highest good. And then um, an opening, a new opening for connections that are in alignment with your North Node. People who are in alignment with you, people who are on the same page, people who are your soulmates, your soul tribe, you know, people who are, who are in harmony with you. And that is what's going to happen. So for some of you guys, it's going to come like a shock. It's going to come like, what the hell? Like. Who are you? Like, what are you doing? Like, what are you, what are you doing here? What, like, what do you want? You may be in a position to where you may be thinking that or maybe feeling that uh, maybe a little paranoia because of the way that things happen. I don't know how it's going to happen, but it's like it's going to be something that like it's going to get your attention. That's what I'm going to just tell you. Whatever is going to happen, whatever is going to take place, it is going to get your attention. But it's all coming about, you know, you fighting for what you want. Seven of Wands. OK, you're standing up for yourself. Spirit said, even when you're meeting new people, I don't care if it's if it's that one that you're destined to be with. Make sure that your own personality and your own individuality is present in the situation at all times. Not at not one point should it be that you are uh, suppressing who you really are, that you are perpetrating a fraud, that you're playing a role or people pleasing. No people pleasing. Be yourself at all times. Be your individual self at all times when it comes to this new connection, these new meeting, meeting new people. Either they won't like you or they not. Let me tell you something. The ones that are meant to be in your life, they're going to appreciate you for who you are. So um, make sure that you're always being yourself and you're always allowing you to shine brightly through. OK, give me another one with this new faded person. What what advice? Ooh, something flew. Something flew. Yeah. M the moon in reverse no secrets everything out on the table i feel like this is going to be somebody who's going to have everything out on the table too this is follow your intuition the high priestess you may be meeting another person who's also a high priest or high priestess what i mean by that is that you are tapped and tuned in with your intuition comment down if you are a high priest or high priestess and what that means is that you tapped and tuned in with your intuition that cctv spiritual cctv is on all the way and you pick up what is being put down? You know what's being put down. Nobody can't pull the wool over your eyes because you're getting those downloads. You get that intuition. That energy comes to you and nothing is hidden with the moon in reverse. Okay. So Spirit is saying when you're building those foundations, make sure that you are um, asking for what you want. Being true to you. Not allowing anybody to make you compromise in a way that it goes against your own highest good, right? Make sure that whatever you do, it's in alignment with who you are as an individual and it um, speaks to who you are, right? Yeah. So uh, moving on here, we have something about an approval. Like choose to approve of yourselves and others will too about approval, all right? Approve of yourself. Find out who you are. If you don't know who you are right now before you start meeting new people, let this be that time that you're finding out who you are as an individual um, so that you will be present, fully present in who you are as an individual when you meet that person. OK, and this is new friendships coming in. I feel like you see, we have friendships and toxicity. I know this is a reverse. I don't feel like trying to fix it right now. But, yo, you're getting ready to talk toxic friendships here. OK, those toxic friendships are going out the door. All right. Let me pull some more cards, energy here. Oh, what else we got here? I'm going to use this. What is this? Career and life. Career and life. Let's see what's going on in career and life. For the collective, first card out. We got is trapped. Some of you guys may have been feeling stuck in your current situation, but know that you have options. If you felt like you didn't have, uh, have options before, those are going to be becoming... Um, 
it was right in my head. That word was right in my mind. <laughs> Those are going to be... <laughs> what the hell? Those are going to be um, becoming prevalent, okay? You feel stuck in your current situation, but you do have options. Look for another job while keeping the one you have for now. So if you guys... If you guys are not liking what you're doing as a career, the the message here is that you don't got to stay there. Nobody's telling you, and not for what, do not misconstrue the message. Nobody's telling you to quit your job and then go looking for another job. No. If you don't like where you are and you know that you can have better, you can do better, you can receive better, you can be learning better, da -da -da, better environment for yourself, start looking. Start looking for something else. I'm hearing that there's something else out there for you. I just had a conversation with somebody before about this same scenario. And what happened was, is that they turned around after that conversation. I'll tell you within, within, uh, about three weeks, was it three weeks? Let's say within a month, <laughs> they found a job within a month. They well, I had that conversation with them. I sat there and talked to them. I felt the energy transmuted that energy and they had a job within a month know that you have options don't never let nobody push have push you up in a corner and make you feel like oh well you need me you you can't be nothing without me and this goes for any type of relationship or connection or whatever you're doing don't let anybody push you into a corner to make you feel like that you're not worthy or that you can't find better or that uh uh there's nothing better out there. The grass is not greener. Don't let, don't fall for that. Okay, so you are going to when once you apply that 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 advice that I'm just telling you, once you apply that, you are going to fall into this experience of fast changes. Things are going to be changing for you quickly, but you have to be on board and you have to be a willing participant. You have to have that faith. You have to be the one that makes that that takes that those steps and takes that action. Okay. We got fast changes. You'll be leaving a job suddenly or getting one very quickly. Or your work may change dramatically in a short time. Go with the flow. Yeah, go with the flow. So some of you guys may be changing jobs and changing jobs or finding new jobs. Either way, there's some there's new energy that's that's slated to come into your life, right? Uh things are not meant to stay stuck and stagnant. Sometimes we don't we, we get comfortable. And we get content in, in, in our little bubble and what we got going on. And it's like, no, you need, you're meant to be moving forward. You're meant to be evolving. You are meant to be uh, excelling in life. And that is what God is pushing you to, to excel in life and, and to be in that, 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 that energy. Okay. Uh, let's see what else we have here for you guys. We got world energy here. Okay. The world energy that came out on these cards mm, was... Theater and prison, which gave me the, um, which the immediate message that popped into my head is that you may see some sort of celebrity. Okay. We're getting into the entertainment here. Celebrity. You know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't usually channel stuff like this, but with the help of these cards, that's somebody may want to, somebody may need to hear it because there may be a message there for you guys as well. Anyways, um, there may be some sort of actor actress rapper singer um this is somebody that's on the world stage this is somebody that's in the public eye okay this is somebody who could um who performs on stage or performs in front of an audience who does concerts who sells tickets somebody like that maybe go into prison for something that has been done okay somebody may be going to prison maybe you may hear about that okay about some celebrity okay that is going to prison okay what else we got in here towards this yeah this is somebody who's global okay hmm i'm getting <laughs> what i just heard secrets about the earth secrets about gaia Secrets about something that is taking place right now are going to come out. Okay. Some secret information. Well, some information that was held secret is going to be revealed. Okay.
why are we talking about this celebrity still? Yo, it's we we still on this celebrity. It's some sort of somebody may hear about some sort of celebrity who I'm getting casting couch because we got taking pictures and job interviews. Somebody here has somebody some sort of celebrity here. Okay, was God saying go with the flow? Some celebrity. Okay. What? I'm getting some sort of celebrity interviewed for a movie and something something that took place during that interview. Something or they were interviewing somebody, something like that. Something is gonna come out. Something that was caught on camera, caught on film. It could this could be somebody who is a higher up, somebody who interviews people for positions within their company like like let's say somebody like a movie director interviewing people to be in their movie or like um a record exec or something like that um having people come in for meetings to sign contracts something took place that that is going to incriminate this person something somebody may have promised somebody a job promised somebody a career and they didn't do it. Somebody's going to jail. Okay. I don't know who this is and what this got to do. Cause he ain't got nothing to do with me. Cause I'm not in that kind of field. You feel me? I'm not in the kind of, this is somebody, it has to do with somebody who was new to the game, who didn't know about the game. So you may hear about something like that on the news. Okay. Anyways, let's get up out this energy. <laughs> Some of you guys may be thinking about learning new things, taking up new hobbies. Uh, some of you guys may be going to, um, to school again. Yeah, this, this, it, it, it keeps, I, I keep looking in this deck and it keep, keeps coming out. Something, gonna, something, something's going to be exposed on the news. If it comes out, come back here and tell me, come back here and tell me what this is. Somebody is going to be exposed in the news and somebody is going to go to jail behind it. Jail is on the forecast for this person. Whoever the hell this is, jail prison is on a forecast for this person tell me about money tell me about money 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 how is money looking for the collective how is money looking for the collective okay how is money looking for the oh some sort of exciting new offers coming through a new job offer a new money making opportunity okay spirit say with this new money making opportunity that you have if you if you choose to take it, save some of that money. Hold on to some of them coins. You're gonna be, you're gonna be getting um, some sort of opportunity that's gonna allow you to be able to have some additional income. Um, I'm getting um, what do you call it? Multiple income streams, and spirit is telling you to make sure that you save some of that money, whatever that is, whatever this is coming through for you. Whether you're getting money from somebody, somebody giving you something. Or you're having some sort of opportunity or you're getting an, uh, an interview or a job offer or a side hustle, whatever it is, it's going to allow you to gain money to where you're able to save. OK, so you might be doing two things, whatever it is, make sure that you're saving your coins. OK, that is what I got for you guys for this message. If you like it, like the video. But if you like it, like the video, subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see more. And if this resonated for you, please comment in the comment section down below. Much love and light to everybody out there. Fa'afitai tele lava. Mahalo nui loa. Obrigado. Anangaseo. Arigato. Ciao.